Hi guys, me Magmona here, and today we're going to be playing some more Asphalt 9. So, I'm currently reviewing every single Lamborghini in this multiplayer series, and in this video, I'm, I'm going to be driving this, the Lamborghini Veneno. Let's get straight into this. So, the Lamborghini Veneno is currently the uh, quote-unquote best car that you can you can unlock from the career mode, uh, ever, since, ever since it got like revamped and chapter 6 was added in. Um, so far, I'm still making, pro I'm still progressing towards unlocking this car by, I haven't managed to get it just yet, but I'm pretty close, I'm like, less than 20 blueprints away from getting it. This is S141, S, no, S, not S1, this is not Forza, um, S class, uh, 4148, this is rank, and it has a speed of 240 miles per hour, so I'm going to compare this to the Chen scenario. You should definitely watch that video out, if, or check that video out if you haven't. Um, top, spe top speed is 5 miles per hour faster. Uh, nitro efficiency is definitely better. Um, ex and, uh, and, also, and so is the handling. Um, that's the acceleration, I can't quite tell, it feels kind of average. To me though, oh, okay. That, oh, ow. <laughs> that hurt. Actually, the, actually, the acceleration not bad. Pretty good acceleration. Fortunately, we weren't, we weren't able to do good in this race, but we should be able to do the next one. Okay, we're on another race. Oh yeah, look at that acceleration. Got already up to like 150 miles per hour. So yeah, it's def it's it's like slightly better. It's still average at acceleration, obviously, but it's definitely at least a little bit better than the Chen scenario. Yeah, overall, I, I'd say this is this is basically uh, this, this is definitely a good card to go for if you want if you want something good for S class or at least something decent for S class. But in in terms of S in terms of S class itself, it's not really a, it's not it's not really king by any means. It's kind of it's kind of at the lower half of the class. Okay, let's try and catch up. Maybe take first. We can hit. Okay, that was weird. Go 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 go. Oh yes, he hit the wall. Second place for Veneno. Not bad. Not bad. You know the final race here. Should I get some slow stream of this guy? There you go, Veneno, go. It kinda reminds me of the of the Volcano. The the Icona. Um, because it has the same speed as it. Um, natural efficiency, I definitely say, is better. Uh, handling, though, hand handling's weird. I feel like the Arcana's but handling might be better. Acceleration is definitely better for the for the Veneno, though. Okay, let's go this way. Okay, let's see if we can maintain first here. Try not to lose. Just try not to do anything stupid. Okay, nice stable landing there. The video does feel a little stiff at times, kind of like the Chen scenario. But overall, it's not bad. It's not. It's not as floaty as the Chen scenario. Definitely more planted, which is probably why it has it has that kind of stiffness feeling at times. Oh, like right there. Let's go. Okay, even despite that dodgy ending, still managed to win. And that's going to be the end of this video. So overall, Veneno, definitely a decent car to go for. Um, it's definitely a step up from the Centenario, but I'd say a bit harder to drive. Anyways, that's, anyways, uh, thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, all the super stuff. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!